Yo, what is going on guys? This is DJP3Games, and welcome to episode number 14 of Pokemon Red and Blue Randomized Nuzlocke Versus with my boy, Jetpack Ahoy. How are you doing today, brother? A lot better now, man. A lot better now is right. Yeah. So, if you guys are wondering why we're why we're so happy, we, we made a breakthrough in uh, randomizing 3DS games. We were having some trouble following tutorials, all this stuff. I couldn't figure it out. But Jet figured it out. We figured it out as a team, man. So, um, a, a solo series will be coming soon, is all I can say. The art has been done for, by the time you guys are seeing this episode, the art has been done for like almost two months now, and I just couldn't figure out how to <laughs> randomize the game. So, that'll be happening. The solo series will come back, and I'm stoked. Yeah. And I'm also stoked to get this episode going. So let's go ahead and right. get that timer ready. Three, two, one, let's boogie. Alright, and as you guys can see in the last episode I did defeat Lieutenant Surge, I uh, decided to skip all the trainers. Yeah, and uh, I made it through Rock Tunnel um, almost in one piece. We did lose Clem, uh, but you know we're here, we're doing the thing. We are now in Celadon City. So yeah, you were like, you're kind of way ahead of me, but at the same time you're kind of not. Yeah, I'm I'm maintaining my like one episode gap. Yeah, well, I do I do have a full team of six and some power in the PC, and there you go. I'm I mean, gonna I, go. F I think the first thing I'm gonna do I'm just gonna go fight Erica, man. Hey, I mean, might as well. I don't think I'm just gonna do the thing. Uh, okay, then Pokemon is not what I'm looking for. Uh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, I'm just gonna ignore those trainers down there. I I do have trainers on that route I could go battle, but I'll battle the ones on the way to the Rock Tunnel. So I want to say Erica's highest level is like 28 or 29. I don't know. I have two very under-leveled uh, team uh, party members at the moment, so... Yeah, uh, you definitely want to be careful. Nah, dude, I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm ready. I feel like you definitely got the opportunity to... You probably could have got a couple more encounters. Yeah, probably. That's all right, though. She got a Nitto. Uh, she's got a Nitto Queen. I really wish I had my Cloister. Oh uh, yeah, that'd be helpful. It's okay. I got a Doctor Phil. Doctor Phil. Oh yeah, I forgot you got him in the last episode too. I did, and he's got confusion, so that should hurt this Nitto Queen pretty good. Oh, I can also get an encounter on this route. Forgot about that. There we go. Did get about fifty percent. That's two. not bad. Oh, and we got the confusion lit. I'm hoping just to get through Rock Tunnel in this episode. I would be, I'll be satisfied. Dude, so I gotta tell you a story. Story time. Because this story made me feel bad about myself. Oh. So earlier today, I was I went to my niece's birthday party, and I'm standing there, I'm talking to my youngest brother and my brother-in-law. We're just talking, you know, BS and. And apparently, I let the word lit slip into conversation one too many times, because oh. then they started making fun of me. Oh, no. Uh, apparently, that's not a word that people say in real conversation. I, I mean, I use it. Sometimes. I use it, apparently, too much. Because we were talking about like new movies and stuff, I'm like, yeah, the movie's going to be so lit, and they're like, what? <laughs> what the fuck did you just say? And then my, bro my my youngest brother was like, "You sound you sound like one of those you know, one of those swag people, blah blah blah, like you know the ones that say like fire and fam and you know keeping it a hundred. I'm like, well, no, I don't say any of that. Uh, that that's geeky. <laughs> right there. That's... Yeah, that's true. But it's like it's it's interesting how one word in your vocabulary can instantly like allow people to define you, know, you a certain way. Yeah, yeah, yeah they're trying to define you, and that that's ridiculous. Because I like to think of myself, and I know that my, my, the people in my family definitely understand, like, I'm a very, and this sounds kind of weird, but, like, I'm, I'm a pretty intelligent person. Mm -hmm. uh, at least I like to think that I am. You know, I, I'm educated, I'm pretty articulate, and so letting one word define, like, what you think of me, I think, is ridiculous. Oh, yeah, I definitely agree. So, I mean, so. We, we've definitely had some pretty in-depth conversations and stuff like that. Um, yeah. I feel like the, like I don't do it too often in my recordings. I do it sometimes, but I'd say the biggest takeaway from people when I have conversations with them is they're like, yo, mm -hmm. you curse a lot. And I'm like, 
dude, I don't even notice I'm doing it, and I'm just letting the F-bombs yeah. slip, like, like every other oh, sentence. Dude, I let F-bombs drop like nobody's business. I, I do, I curse a lot. TM40, what is this going to be? I think Would mainly it's because due to, like, the nature of the work I'm in, and also being in the military. Mm, yeah, the military will do that to you for sure. Yeah. Because we, like, we uh, don't even notice we're doing it. Oh, this TM40 is metronome. No, I mean, that, that's just that's just a part of the culture. Yeah, it, it really is. So, I mean, like, anybody else that's in the military that's watching this, you know, you definitely understand where I'm coming from. And that's not to say that everybody in the military cusses like, like you know, I guess, no pun intended, cusses like a sailor. But, mm -hmm. like, <laughs> I mean, you know, I, I guarantee you 90% of the people you know in the military do. Oh, yeah. That's just the way it is. Yo, I didn't know Clamp was a continuous move. It is. Yes, it is. That's not bad. No. And it's strong, too, when it lands. Yeah, like, I just took out a Rhyhorn pretty easy. I remember always used to try to, like, find a Rhyhorn in this game, and finding yeah. the Safari Zone was terrible. <laughs> yeah. Or catching anything in the Safari Zone was I terrible. I want to say, like, several summers ago, um... I did a lot of playing uh, Pokemon Red and Blue on mm. uh, Pokemon Stadium because I had the mm. uh, the cart like the game cartridge things on the back yeah. of the controller, yep. and I'm pretty sure I had like a complete Pokedex on both games. That's impressive. Yeah, and I don't I don't know what happened to those games. I don't know if I sold them or if I or what happened to them. <laughs> if I sold them, I definitely probably didn't sell them for enough money. <laughs> That's true. Um, I think. It wasn't last summer, the summer before. Like I, I played a lot of uh, first through third gen, um, like because I just I had them on my phone. Oh yeah, I, I've had them on my and phone. And so before. I, I would play them at work and stuff. Same. Which at the time uh, I'll admit was pretty irresponsible and almost dangerous of me because I, I was I, like I worked uh, on cars for a living back then. Oh yeah yeah. So, like, I would be down at the pit, like, in the pit underneath the running vehicles and stuff, and, like, I'm sitting there on my phone playing Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> Priorities, man. They're like, Robbins, what are you doing? And I'm like, uh, catching a Pidgey? What's up, dude? <laughs> What's up, dude? <laughs> what you need? All right, I used to play it on my really phone, should... um, like, during breaks and stuff, but... Yeah. I really should have healed my Pokemon. Holy crap, that's a level 29 Scyther. Dude, I told you, level 29. Yikes. Nice. I'm just wishing I would have healed myself before jumping into this battle. I mean, the good thing is you've got that super effective Moltres against it. Your Moltres is probably, what, yeah. 26 or 27? Uh, 28. 28, yeah, exactly. So you're only one level underneath. I've also got uh, a Graveler with a two t uh, four times effective Rock Throw. So there you go. I'm about to uh, <laughs> get an encounter here in this route before the rock tunnel. You should actually be able to get two encounters, because the route going towards rock tunnel is different from that mm. patch of grass above the Pokemon Center. Is it? It is. It's like a, right, hmm. it's like a route 9 and 10 or something like that. Yeah, but you I don't think you can use uh, route 10 until you get surf. No, because that, that patch of grass that's above the uh, Pokemon Center counts as route 10. Hmm. I don't know if I got a second counter. I'm not going back. It's too late. Yep. I, I, <laughs> make, I make sure my encounters count. Alright. Scyther's dead. Tinamon is putting in work, though. Oh. This Golbat's probably going to be an issue. I guess I guess I have a Graveler. It'll be okay. Oh, God damn it. We got paralyzed. Why? Why you do this? <laughs> Why you do this to me? Have you uh, seen seen the show Riverdale? Uh, no. It's it's pretty decent. Um, we watched. I think it was season two. Just finished that last night. Pretty is it on Netflix? It is. It's about uh. It's about. It's about. Paint me a word picture. So basically, it's about like these um, high schoolers, and it, like a bunch of like just like murders and like different stuff happens, and they're like trying to figure out, and they're all like caught up in it, like. It's like a modern show that's like caught up in like basically like seventies, eighties like gang life almost. Huh. There's biker gangs and all kinds of stuff like that. It sounds interesting. 
I, it's pretty decent. I'll and that check could it have out. been like a bad description oh. as well. Um, guess what else Erica has? Um, a Mewtwo. No, a level 29 Articuno that I think has just killed my Graveler! Yep. <sighs> oh, Cubone. My level 29 Graveler is gone from a single Ice Beam from an Articuno. Wow. So that leaves you what with Moltres? Yep. Or why didn't why didn't you switch out? I feel like that would have been the uh... because I I thought like Rock Throw would kill it, which it probably would have if it would have outsped. But it's a Graveler against an Articuno; it's not going to outspeed. I just wasn't thinking. I don't, did I? Hit? No, I didn't have a Marowak in this one. For the reset. Because because it's an easy it's an easy dub with Moltres and Fire Spin. That makes me really Alright, I caught Cubone. <laughs> I think my dogs are fighting. Graveler died for no reason. Alright, I caught a Cubone. It's gonna be Return of Ghost Rider. I don't know when he evolves, but I'm probably not gonna use him. Because he's only level 13. <laughs> she gives me the TM for Pin Missile. What is this? That's definitely not worth my Graveler's life. <laughs> Probably not. On the plus side, I got my fourth badge. So, we are halfway to the Pokemon League, boys. Halfway. What? And now they're coming in here. I hope they don't start We're fighting here. Because otherwise we might have to cut and I kick them out. Whoa, living on a prayer. Alright, so, um, question for you. What's up? Because there are, um, there's a static encounter here, um, in the game corner. Yeah, uh, there's we're just... also other static encounters in that city. There is, there's an Eevee that I'm gonna go grab. Um, just one Pokemon from the, from the game corner, yeah? Yeah, I'd say that's fair. Okay. Because, I mean, if you, if you want to sell stuff and spend the money to get it, then, yeah. Yeah. Cool. Are, I, now, I didn't know that was gonna like... be randomized? They should be. Alright, that's that's what I was thinking. Uh, I believe they are. Let's Poor Smeagol. I was eight levels away from getting a golem. Dang, boy. Yeah, a golem would have been powerful. On the plus side, I can pull this Rhyhorn out of the PC. Yo, Rhyhorn's pretty good, too. As long as... Uh, I think it's kind of on a slow side. God damn it, I'm yeah. asleep now. Oh, my whole... I'm so seriously under-leveled right now. Dude, yeah, so you definitely need those uh, static encounters and stuff. Yeah. I feel like you're really and not I, I, that underleveled. Because, uh, like, your Moltres is 28, so... So... My Moltres is, is 29 now. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, thank but god. I thought I was er Erica two had two 29s, the rest of my team. So this is my team. A level 9, two level 18s, and a level 29. Jeez. So what was that about not being underleveled? <laughs> well, I mean, not that underleveled. God, this Wigglytuff keeps putting all my Pokemon to sleep. It's okay. We're gonna be all right. I just gotta, I just gotta maintain this lead. I thought she was gonna put this another Pokemon to sleep, and I was gonna be like, God damn it! <laughs> all right. Yeah, I hope this Eevee is something good. Metal grew to level twenty-four. Please be something good. I always thought this was weird. How you just walk into this dude's like office and steal his Pokemon? It's a pincer. Hey, there you go. And it mm. should be at level twenty-five. Um, let's see. What do we name you? Uh. Ah. Uh, I might have to go back to Cerulean City and get potions. Actually, I might I be okay. Know, I don't know what to name you. Hey, I mean, take your time. Right. My name is Executioner. Ooh. Will that fit, though? Uh. It might. You might have to leave out an no. E or something. I'm one 
So what I'm gonna do? Oh, damn it. There's not a lot of item down there. I'm gonna do this like super edgy. Super edgy. Yeah, just start with the X. Oh my goodness. All right, so it's the only way it fits. <laughs> That's fine. So I'm about to and go into the rock tunnel. <laughs> that looks weird, man. <laughs> like so weird that it looks wrong. Yeah, it looks very wrong. All right, I'm gonna get this. The only, the only moves he has are vice grip and seismic toss. Yeah, mine only has vice grip. Well, I taught it clamp and cut. So I can actually get an encounter here and then an encounter. Oh, I have a Pokemon that can learn cut now, so uh, this far fetched can go away. <laughs> Fire! I'm <laughs> fetched. Okay, this is a ponyto, so that is species claws. It is indeed. Because you're rapid useless ash. rapid ashes in the PC. Yep, it is. He's just chilling, waiting for his time to shine. Oh my god, it's a Paris. Paris! Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna forfeit this encounter. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Paris uh, evolves with a leaf stone too, doesn't it? Uh, maybe? I wanna say it does. You know, I'll battle this chick. I feel like she deserves to be battled. Watch, I probably have like right. a Mewtwo or something stupid. <laughs> Oh, this is that sprite you were talking about um, in an earlier episode with like her. Oh, she got an Alakazam. God damn it! <laughs> with a what? Her legs are like all weirdly bent. Yeah. There's like a curve for no reason. My vice grip. Yeah. Right, Coin so case required. Has, Crap. Alakazam should just have confusion. That does a lot. And I'm gonna have to switch out. Where do you get the coin case in this game? Poop. In Celadon City. Alright. I'll find it. Um... Yeah, that Alakazam did confusion on my uh, pincer and took out over half its health, so I was like. Oh, <laughs> yikes. But uh, we took it out, though. Oh, yeah, you're right in here. I, I know where it's at in the restaurant. And he also hey, give me has that a coin growlith. Case. Hey, thanks, man. Oh, you found uh, it already? Pin, isn't isn't pin missile a bug type move? Mm, I believe so. Should be. I'm gonna. Of course, my pincer can't learn it. Oh no, my uh, hunter knows horn attack. So there's that. Psst! There's a basement under the game corner. Don't tell anybody I told you. Yo, Thor's at level 26. I wish he evolved into Electivire in this game. <laughs> that would be powerful. That's what I'm waiting for. Like, when we get to, like, 4th gen, we'll have some chance yep. to get some, like, more diverse teams and, like, actually yeah. have some powerful movesets and powerful mods. Yo! 120 coins. I'm getting the Vaporeon, dog. No shit. Yeah. I think it's level 15, though. Uh, the first one, I think it'll be level 5, actually. Oh, yikes. Hope you find an experience share. Alright, I am in the rock tunnel. Oh, I forget how easy it is to, like, get through here, because everything's, like, kind of, like, lit up. And Dragonair yeah. is my encounter, so that's dupes. Yeah, that's also dupes. That's, that's crazy. I didn't, want, I didn't want to talk to you again, old man. I'm battling this technician that looks like a god. Yo, normally I think he does have a slowpoke, and he's got a slowpoke this time. Oh, the first guy in Rock Tunnel? Yeah. yeah. There's two trainers that I always remember in Rock Tunnel, because there's the first one with the slowpoke, and then there's one, like, halfway through that always has an exploding graveler. Hmm, yep. Yeah, I just found a hundred coins laying on the floor. There you go. Yeah, <laughs> I remember the little spots to pick them up. I should take out the slowpoke. The slowpoke's got a headbutt. Give me this Vaporeon. Yes, I do want it. I'm not just using Tintamon trying to get him leveled up. And he's got a Porygon. I'm gonna name it Aqua. Aqua? Highly original. Oh, uh, yeah, it's level 6. <laughs> Dang. I always used to get the Abra there. But it does know Water Gun, so that's good. Or like in, uh... 
what is it in Johto? I think Gen two you can get like a tire or a Larvitar or something. Or yeah. Some game. I don't remember. So I finally have a team of six. Just there they're you all go. incredibly under leveled. Team of six. We both got teams of six. They range from level six to level eighteen. <laughs> I think all my four are badges. That. In. That's not good. I think my lowest is level sixteen, and that's my seal. And my highest is twenty six. Oh, I can still get an encounter here. I was about to use a repel. It's another Dragonair. Uh, hopefully I can find something decent, though. There we go. Yo, so it's a Squirtle. What up? Let's go. That's dope. Jinx. You owe me a soda, dude. Do you take PayPal? Yep. Alright, I, th I think we can work something out here. <laughs> the thing is being able to co uh, catch this um, Squirtle on a Pokeball. Yo, do you think my level 8 Vaporeon can beat this level 20 Flareon? Yes. Definitely. Alright. Going in. <laughs> oh yeah, I caught the Squirtle. Nice. That's it. Really impressive, considering how difficult, like how high of a catch rate the starters oh, have. What did, what did I name my Squirtle in uh, Crystal? Mm. Name it Shell Shock. I think that's what I named it. Shoutouts to the uh, the Pokemon movie. Right. Mewtwo Strikes Back. I remember when that movie first came out. Went and saw it in theaters. I think I went and saw it in theaters as well. I definitely remember seeing um, the third movie. I still have my, uh, oh, my no. promo ancient Mew oh, card. Fuck. What happened? I misspelled shell shock. Actually, I I went up <laughs> like my my controller sometimes messes up, and it'll like <laughs> skip two spaces. So instead of putting a K, I put an M. Shell shock him. Shell shock him. Shell shock him. <laughs> All right. I don't know why that's as funny to me as it is. I mean, it's kind of funny. <laughs> Shell shock him, boys. Shell shock him. Well, there the Squirtle's we level 17, so I might replace... Uh, I'll probably put the Squirtle on the team and take off Seal. I would. 110%. This Dugong is level 25. Ooh, it used a Roar Beam. Hopefully that's not super effective. Dugong, gong, gong, gong. Oh lord, that was close. Our hideout might be discovered. I gotta tell the boss. Yeah, you tell your boss. You tell your boss we're coming. Coming for that ass, Geo. You owe me that ass. <laughs> okay. You solar beam on this Dugong? Solar beam that hoe, now watch me do. Go, go, go. <laughs> oh, it's a far fetched. Alright, 10 mongers of 21. I think that was all the Pokemon we had. Yep, Shaw was. We're sitting at about 2 minutes. 2 minutes left. I'm 2 prob minutes. Probably not gonna get out of the uh, rock tunnel that time. Yeah, it, it took me just over 1 episode to get out of there. The thing is, I have repels though. And I did not. So, I just... I only have, like, I think one or two more. But that should be enough to get me out. I just gotta battle the mandatory trainers. This chick's got a Charmander. Let's go to Origin. I'm gonna use... It's kind of dangerous. I'm gonna go ahead and use Clamp, though. So, it it hit. So, we, we should be That's Gucci. Good. Oh, we hit it twice. What up? Confusion should do some decent damage. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I gotta start paying attention to my bag because it's getting pretty full. Yeah, I definitely need to make a trip to the PEC when I get out. Alright. I need to also look up when to evolve my Weeping Bell. 
right now. No, because I think it, it learns like Razor Leaf or something at some point. You broke into our operation? God damn it. Yeah, but I mean, you got Vine Whip, so you're okay. Yeah, but I, I would like to know Razor Leaf too. <laughs> yeah. This guy's got a cloister. Let's go back out to Venus. Alright. Yikes, that really into hurts a little bit. A lot of the uh, the Nito family in this place. The Nito family? Yeah. Pikachu! Right. Uh... You know what's cool about this Pikachu is that it's level 21, but I can send out my level 9 uh, Rhyhorn and it can't touch me. Exactly. That's how you get to Actually, it right might there. have quick attack. I think it will. Yep, it definitely does. But it only uh, does four damage. Why are you so. confusing me? I hate being confused. It only that his quick attack only did four damage, so I'm not worried. That's the timer. Ah. All right. But I am in a battle. I am in a battle too. Stop lowering my attack. You're just dragging this out, Pikachu. You can't win. You're outsmarted and outclassed by a Pokemon half your level. How does that make you feel? Terrible. You fat rat. <laughs> Just destroy this Pikachu real quick. <laughs> oh my god, I'm asleep. Why? Why do you do these things? Why you gotta be like that game? Right. Why, why, you, why you gotta be like that? Why you gotta be so rude? You remember that song? Yeah. A lot of people don't remember that song. Don't you know I'm human too? <laughs> I'm gonna marry her anyway. <laughs> like, uh, alright, dude, I guess. <laughs> I mean, if that's what you're into. Yeah. Alright, I am out of this battle. I'm, I'm doing my last horn attack right now. I just save wrecked the game. this Pikachu. I don't think I had any timestamps at all during that episode. That's no. alright. I mean, I'll have one whenever I get <laughs> to Pokemon Center. Alright. I'm out of battle as well. Alright. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the Versus things. I'm trying to make a comeback. I'm getting a little bit closer, I think. <laughs> so, I, I think I made getting some good progress. So, we will see what happens in the next episode. Until then, make sure you guys check out the links down in the description below. I greatly appreciate it. And we will see you guys next time. Peace. Bye.